Um, that's a hard question because you know sometimes I'm in it, I don't know I'm in it. So it's kind of hard to judge, but uh, I've been there often. I left some notes for the next guy who visits often. Um, you know, left some notes to tell him how not to go. I've learned, I've learned uh, the ways uh, in the Iowa way and how to do things right. Um, I think, and I'm going to do my best to to keep it that way for the duration of the rest of my career. Is this overblown? All this stuff that you know, coaches don't like you. you don't like the coaches. It's it's a little bit overwhelming sometimes. Uh, you know, I'll be in class, I'll be in Poncheros, you know, I'll be around Iowa City, and uh, you know, people make comments about you know, you know, me and, and my relationship with Coach Ferentz, and it's it, sometimes it's it's, humor, you know, it's really humorous. You know, uh, people will inbox me and message me on Facebook. And, I mean, hundreds of messages a day from fans and that about like, what's going on. You know? As much as I want to, uh, you know, tell them that it's it's not as bad as you think, but you know, it's it's just best. You know, we, Iowa, we keep things in house. You know, and uh, you know, on both sides, uh, the coaches do and the players do. We try to uh, with everything, injuries, uh, relationships, and that type of deal. But um, I, you know, I wouldn't change anything that's happened to me. My relationship with uh, Coach Ferentz. I would train, train my head coach, train my head coach. Uh, you know, he's taught me a lot of lessons.